being desirous of growing your career is not a negative it's a positive so we are happy that you are coming in and wanting to do a course to grow in your career if, right if this drive was not there the reason why b school would exist would disappear would disappear b schools are and exactly there for uh, feeding this drive i'll tell you what doesn't go down very well is if you are attracted by some glamour stories of somebody earning 5 crores and 10 crores per year and you come in into mba for that reason that doesn't work what you can always say is look at the company that you have signed up for so i'll take an example suppose it's tata motors you say look sir if i were a graduate engineer trainee and i'm continuing in tata motors for let's say 4 years i will just go on to the head of production level and it will take me 15 years to go there but if i do an mba i realize that i can join on the sales and marketing side and actually achieve a faster growth and i would like to do that and i'm excited by the possibilities of growing faster and therefore i would like to invest my time in doing a course which will dramatically grow my skill sets unless i explain for in fact if you have 4 years of experience all your rationale should be based on better career growth based on what is actually happening in your industry so if you spend 4 years in it we'll actually ask you you are in tcs right now you spend 4 years after mba tcs will again hire you as a business analyst okay so why don't you go and join a business analyst right now why do you need to do an mba and they are many times not able to answer so what exactly is this new role that you are looking out for is the answer that one needs to be clear about